Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. This is Tanya Psychic Crafts. Guess what I have? I have a haul for you. <laughs> Does scrapbook.com have their own envelopes? This envelope was left on my porch this morning because I shopped. That's why. Because I shopped. And I got some goodies. I gotta figure out how to, oh, there it is. There's a tab to open the sucker. Let's get this tape pulled back though. I don't think it'll tear through that. Oh, good grief. Oh, good grief. So, um, I've been a little MIA again. <laughs> it's been a little crazy at work. Nothing's slowing down. I had to work a double yesterday. Got a bunch of call outs. It's just been something else. So, I am excited to see this. I'm off tomorrow, and I do plan to take my time off like I'm supposed to because I need it very bad. And um, yeah, I'm sure y'all understand. I need to get to my crafty friends too. I've got orders to complete. I've got swaps to finish. I've got prizes to give away if you won my last prizes. I am so sorry. I have not been able to get those prizes out yet. They're coming, I promise you. Promise, 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 I promise. I'm gonna get those together tomorrow. That is my task for the day tomorrow so here we are I'm so excited I went and found some of that paper that I loved and then added a few things to it I'm super super excited to see this oh, look at this remember the um the paper that Janet used the other day was the curator's botanical by 49 and market I found it at scrapbook.com look they put a little thingy in there these are rub-on transfers they're gorgeous. They're much larger than I thought they'd be. Got stamps and flowers. Wow. So it comes with a 112 by 12 transfer sheet and the rub-on tool. These are beautiful because you don't have to use the whole thing. You can just use portions of it. That's really pretty. Man, I'm excited about that. Okay, and then, of course, you know, had to get the paper too. Let's see, where's, here's that paper. Here's the collection. Okay, let's open this up. This paper was just so pretty. This is something that I can see myself buying again and again, actually, because it's just so beautiful. I love the colors that were used. The blues and the purples, look at that. The greens. Very cute. I'm so glad she turned me on to this paper because I hadn't noticed it before. Look at, I love the botanicals, I love the flowers. And then on the other side of that one is that. They're great for ta journaling tags or anything really, journaling cards I mean. And we've got some writing here. Look at that, love it, love the colors. That one's kind of plain on the other side too. These are great. Ooh, I love that one. I love it. Blue is not my favorite color, but in a, in a way like this, I mean, I don't dislike blue, but I would, I'm um, very drawn to this. Love it. Birds, plants, Hope you guys can see all that fruit trees and plants. Look at that, how sweet is that? That's really nice on there too. I like the subtle print of the flowers there and the writing. There we go, yellow and green. Gorgeous. This is the one that drew me. This is the what she used in, the, in her project. Beautiful, and look at this one. The purples, the yellows, and the oranges, the greens. Love the graph paper. Beautiful, oh, I'm so happy, I'm so happy. <laughs> All right, and then I got, look, I still have the butterflies from her, her wrapping paper. I'm fussy cutting them. I've got quite a few of them cut out already, but I'm working on it. <laughs> cut them into smaller, manageable pieces. All right, and then I added some more. Oh, 
Um, oops, there's more papers there. Forget those. I ordered some individual sheets. This one. I don't remember. I don't think these are with that kit. I think these are different. Yeah, these are the um, the sh from the Sherbet collection. But I thought they would be beautiful with these. And I just love the colors and the... Look at that. Isn't that neat? And I got the blue. This one's called... Um, the color on this one was... Tidal Wave? Blue Moon. Sorry. Blue Moon is that one. This one was... Um, lemonade. This one's Blue Moon. Love white oranges. Really cool. And then this one, let's see, this one's Limeade. I like that a lot. I should have got two of those. Limeade. And this one's Floralogy. This is the one sheet that was in the pack. I got a second one. Very cute. And I got a free gift. I got double-sided tape as a free gift. It's tiny thin. But I've never used their double-sided tape yet, so I'm anxious to try that out. And I like this. I don't have any of this width either, so that's kind of nice. That'll be great for shakers. Um, what's this? Farm Sweet Farm. Look at the animals. In the house. This is cute. Scrapbook.com P13. I'm going to have to check this collection out. This is cute. says, touch me. This is the same kind of paper we use in our collections. It's nice. Um, I'll have to check this one out. This is really pretty. I love the animals. I don't know. Um, most of my stuff, though, I do for swaps. I don't know. We don't really do much with farms. But I can make me things. I like it. Okay. So this is the botanical tag set. Had to get those. These go along with the collection. And I'll be using this card in the back for sure. Look how pretty that is. And they put the butterflies in the back too. So I'll be able to use that. We've got some tags. She sent me some of these too. These are nice. I love that they have the strings on them already. I don't have to deal with that. And the eyelets. Well worth it. And they're all blank on the other side. Even the plain ones are nice. Stamps. Very cute. These are awesome. So we've got some tags. And let's see if I can stick these. I'm not going to stick these in here. I don't have time for that. <laughs> Ain't nobody got time for that. All right, let's see what's this one. This is still... Oh, this is the vintage... Okay, so I wanted to see this one too. This is the Vintage Artistry Shore Collection. This is the ephemera for the kit. And I got the pad, the small pad too. That's really neat. So I got the ephemera. Let's see what this goes with. Tickets. More tickets and frames. More of the same. I love the colors for these. These will be nice to mix. Uh, these. Well, actually, these might be a little muted for for the other these are page tags look at that one that one's cool Ooh, that one's pretty too they might be nice to mix with that other uh, the other set but i thought they'd be pretty anyway especially with summer coming up and i have some summer swaps to do interesting how they did that cut on the edge that's cool that one looks like it's bent but it's just um that's just the picture that's nice that. A smaller one tickets that one's blank these are fun these are really fun these will be great for um journals for journal cards for sure don't really have to do anything to them just stick them in there sounds like i need to make a summer journal 
means I need to do something so I have something to journal about instead of working all the time. Nobody wants to read about that. Looks like that's all I have to do lately. <laughs> I gotta go on vacation. Lori, I'm gonna come see you this summer. This, oh, hey, there we go. I'm gonna go see my friend Lori this summer sometime. And hopefully Navasha will come play. Let's see. Those are boats, that's cool. Like a, a drawing of a boat. So this is the shore, what was it called? Shore, vintage artistry shore. The jellyfish, they're studos. That's pretty, I love that color, really pretty. Are there two of all of them? Three of all of them? What's going on here? pretty too. It looks like there's three of all of them maybe. One, two, three. Got the seahorse. One, two, three. So there's four prints, three of each looks like. This one. And one extra. <laughs> Pretty too. Yeah, so that's really cool. So um, this is the fussy cut element sheet. So four double-sided collection paper, three sheets of each, four double-sided collection papers, and then one fussy cut element, which would be this one, I guess. Very cool. So these could be cut up and used on the with the papers. That's neat. All right, so there we go. So that is my haul from scrapbook.com. A lot of fun. I'm super excited to use these pieces. Now if I just need to get the day off and have some fun with it. So I hope you guys enjoyed it. Hope you're all doing well. Can't wait to catch up. Leave me a comment. Let me know what you've been doing um, lately. And uh, I promise I've been watching some videos. <laughs> Even if I haven't commented, I've been a little tired. So um, look forward to hearing from you all. I hope you're having a great day. And I will see you in the next video. See you tomorrow. Bye-bye. <laughs>